Morning guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 21. Rocking around the Christmas tree. Okay, so as always I'm running really late and I'm going to Blue Water. Um, I'm wearing my, one of my favourite pairs of boots that I've only actually ever worn once. But they're so cool, let me show you. My mum thinks they're hideous, but she knows nothing. Now I'm just waiting for my dad to get ready, which I feel like he actually takes longer than me, which is just absurd. I've changed my boots because I felt that they looked a bit too evening, so I've just put on my trainers, which kind of match my top, so it's fine. My top is very see-through, though. Oh, well. Okay. I'm gonna go now. Hi, guys. I'm absolutely freezing. I just came in my bedroom and my window was wide open and it was so cold. Okay, it's um, quarter past ten and I actually only got home at quarter to ten, so for the last half an hour I've just been making a thumbnail for my video and I just uploaded my video, so I have been out shopping for the best part of like 12 hours um an hour of that we had to wait for a bus and a train because there was loads of delays loads of traffic and everything so that was a pain in the bum and then the rest of that time was shopping slash eating like we stopped like when we got to blue water we had like a brunch lunch and then we stopped for coffee a couple hours later and then we stopped for dinner another couple hours later so so yeah I only bought one Christmas present and it wasn't even for the person that like needed an extra present so I got my sister a birthday present her birthday's in January but I thought it was more appropriate for her birthday because it's got her star sign on it so I thought that was a little bit better. <sighs> I hate shopping, honestly. God knows how I actually managed to go to Blue Water of all places on I'm only like four days before Christmas when I won't even pop into my local town on a Saturday because I hate it when it's too busy. I get really stressed out with people really easily and I just think everyone is a moron when they're shopping. Like everyone just walks really slow and I'm the one that's like wants to get past you really quickly. Um I have no tolerance for people. And my dad's always just like, just take it how it goes, you're not in a rush, it's fine. And I'm just like, no, I want to get from A to B, and I don't want anyone to get in my way. Um, I just find shopping incredibly stressful. The best time to go shopping is like, like I had the other day at like half eight in the morning in Primark. It's bliss, it's so nice being the only one there. <sighs> One more day left of work and then I'm off for six days, yay. So good. I feel really hungry, considering like, I mean, I didn't finish my dinner because I made the mistake of wearing my super high-waisted jeans that are actually a little bit too tight for me. And you can't sit down and eat in them, it's just not possible. Like, nine times out of ten when I go out for food anyway, I have to undo my jeans. Which is really embarrassing. I, just, I obviously pull my top over it, but... I need, like, to wear... Non-high-waisted jeans more, I think. But the good thing about high-waisted jeans is that you never have, like... You can always bend over. I know that your bum isn't going to be hanging out. Like, if I'm at work and I need to crouch down, I know that no one's going to be seeing down my knickers, because, like, down my trousers, because I'm wearing high-waisted jeans. Whereas, if you wear jeans that are on the hips, the minute you bend down, 
the bum hangs out. <laughs> you probably just think I'm crazy talking about this, but it's true, it's annoying. My waisted jeans are so practical for that reason, but so impractical for other reasons. It's a love-hate relationship between me and high-waisted jeans, you know. I really should go to bed because it's 20 past 10. And I've got to go to work tomorrow. I think I'm going to try and pick up my last bits of Christmas shopping tomorrow. I need to buy like wrapping paper and stuff like that. So can you believe I couldn't find any at Blue Water? Like I didn't like anyone's in Paper Chase or Marks and Spencers or anything. So tomorrow I'm going to go to Trusty Wilkinson's because Wilkinson's has never steered me wrong in the last couple of years, you know. It's going to be my hardcore wrapping day. It took my mum like four hours, I think she said, to wrap about 20 presents. Thus far, I have about 25, 26, 27 presents, so... And I'll be farting around with ribbon and stuff, which my mum doesn't tend to do, so... I'm going to have to set quite a few hours by for wrapping presents. That's weird, my front door's just gone. Who's just gone out? At half ten. Must be my sister. That's really weird. Because she was in her pyjamas like five minutes ago. I'm so confused. Oh well. Um, I'm finally starting to feel a bit warm now. That's good. I was going to say one more thing before I went. Oh yeah. My hair desperately needs washing. I was going to plan to wash when I got home from Blue Water, but we ended up being out for so many hours. But it feels so rank. So tomorrow it's going to have to be a dry shampoo and some kind of hairstyle. Feels horrible. It needs a really good deep condition. That's what it needs. Okie dokes, I'm gonna go to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow for my last day at work. And then, I feel like once I finish work, that's when I'm gonna start to feel really, really Christmassy because my Vlogmas has to be one of the most un Christmassy Vlogmas ever. <laughs> but I'm hoping when I finish work, the two days after that, I'll feel mega Christmassy. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. You will get a sentimental feeling when you hear voices singing. Let's be jolly. Deck the halls with boughs of holly.